What's up guys, this is Mike Loris, going to be playing Medusa, apparently in a tri lane. Was not aware that this was going to happen, but we are all here and we're ready to party. Medusa, I already do have a... Oh my god, my phone just like spazzed out so hard. Um, I already do have a video of... It's supposed to look like that. Uh, by the way, this is what our courier looks like. That's what we're talking about. It literally looks like shit. Like someone took a shit on this courier. It looks so pathetically awful. This thing looks horrible. <laughs> Unless it's like... Oh, yes, look at this battle points. That is from the uh, TI3 compendium. So if you haven't bought it, make sure you pick that one up, support valve. Anyway, Medusa, I already had, do have a video of her. And it looks like I'm just going to be safe farming on this... <coughs> Oh my god, what's going on? My water cup is empty, god damn it. Uh, why do I always do this with an empty cup of water? Anyway, uh, I already do have a Medusa game, and this game I'm just going to be farming, ideally against no one. Looks like something happened to two of the creeps. There they are, it's Marana. So I'm just going to be farming as much as I can. That was actually some pretty good blocking by Marana, but too bad for her that she's now going to be in a lot of pain. I'm a little bit too far away to actually help out with that, so I'm just not going to bother. I'm just going to get these CS instead. And if they get first blood, so be it, but she has leap, so yeah, I didn't really expect much to happen there. So, Medusa, I already do have a video of her. However, I think I'm going to be uh, playing this one a little bit more by ear. I don't really remember what happened in the last game. But I do know that this game we're going to be, first of all, missing CS. And times two. Wow, this is... Yeah, people with bows in this game have really, like, crappy ways of attacking things. Oh my god. <laughs> so bad. So bad. You know what? Screw it. I'm going to get snake and stats. I don't know if that's what I did last time, but I'm going to do it this time. Because I have no confidence in my ability to get gold from these creeps. And if I just get, like, maxed out stats, screw this shield... Through screw split shot, you don't need that. You don't need that. You just need to have enough damage to get last hits. <laughs> until I get that, until I get that, I'm just gonna be jacking up on stats. Of course, probably split shot would help with this, or mana shield, or even both would help out when this happens. But eh, not enough. This is enough though. There we go. Okay. So Mirana's getting nothing out of this lane. I have a giant creep wave behind me for some reason. Not too sure what happened with that. I think Nick Sasson just accidentally is pull. But we're going to be heading on towards a Lincoln Sphere. They have a lot of spells that I would rather not get hit with. Telekinesis, the thing from the Skeleton King, Hellfire Blast, Laser, Lasso. I don't know if Marana's arrow is blocked. I'm pretty sure it is. And, that, and as such, I am not interested in... Uh, getting hit by any of that, so I'm going to try to block as much as I can, especially the arrow and the, the, uh, especially the arrow as well as the lasso. That is something that I'm not interested in at all, so we're just going to be doing as much as we can on this bottom lane, try to get a fast, uh, not that, that's not good, went for a fast bottle, we did get it, but to what end, to what end, actually, this is creep going to die over here, I want this experience, did I get it, no, it's still alive, it's going to get denied. Unless, haha, -ho, thank you, Marana. I'll take the tower shot for that, gladly. Okay, maybe two, that's a little bit too much, but... Oh, wow, she shot an arrow as well. Didn't even realize. Don't even care. My support's keeping me safe. Even if though they're not actively here, just their uh, mere presence in the area is making me feel all, all warm and fuzzy inside. Boots or Ring of Health? I feel like boots would help me a little bit more, and then we'll sell maybe like a stupid shoe of agility and then get a ring of health. That sounds like a plan. Why are these things attacking me not the catapult? The catapult's hitting you and I'm running away. These creeps really gotta get their shit together. What's up, Marana? She went in for the deny. Oh, what a bitch. Alright, time to get some more snake. So we can actually push her out of the lane. Ideally, you want to kind of attack the range creep with the snake so that it bounces and, you know, does more. But, you know, you can't really do that when Marana's playing that far back, so I don't know. You want this? Might not even be worth it for me to get the snake because it's a, it's a nuke, which is nice. The mana steel is actually going to be real nice, so I don't know. It probably is worth it somehow, some way. But not if uh, they everyone keeps dying around the map. But it's fine, I'm still getting the farm. 
Yeah, snake not really going to be too great. I can actually take some harassment now, since I have the double rings. So I'll be able to, uh, you know, take some shots from the creeps. Shoot this person a couple times, or even just shoot the tower. That's fine. We have a siege creep. Might as well shoot a little bit with it. There we go. Put some hurt on the tower, and hopefully not get nailed by an arrow along the way. So we're just going to be happily farming it away. Uh, boots of speed, that's going to be enough for now. Phase boots or power treads. There is a debate rages on as to which one is actually more powerful. Oh, Venomancer, please, no, you're dead. What are you doing, man? What you doing? That was horrible. Venomancer's going to pay for that with his life. You could bet. Marana's coming, and he's dead. Now I'm just really going to go over here so I don't get hit by these towers. That was really dumb of Venomancer. I don't know if he didn't see that the fact that Rubik was there or, or what, but either way, that was silly. Alright, we're going to be tanking that because we are not in any threat. We don't want to lose any last hits of the tower. And with our Ring of Health plus Tangos that we got get rid of, uh, we're going to be okay with taking that damage because we're not in any danger, really. Right? <laughs> right? Okay, we actually should probably clear these off because we're getting a little bit too close to the tower. No, Marana, why you got to be like that? What a meanie. We're fine, we're level 5, she's only level... Whoa, she's level 5, what happened? When did that happen? Last time I checked, she was like level 2. What the hell? I mean, she's getting a solo lane, but... Wow. Yeah, get her. This person should be dead. There we go. Good rotation from the Nyx. Easy pick off on Marana. And now we got our ultimate. So we could uh, turn things to stone. That'll really hurt the uh, Batrider if I could somehow get that slow him to a crawl, but really I don't think it's going to be too big a deal in this game, the ultimate. I mean, maybe the Skelta King is going to try to want to get in there close and try to do some damage to me, but other than that, the ultimate probably is not going to be too impressive. Everyone else is really going to keep their distance. Hey, they got a kill. No, wait. We got a kill. We got killed. And of course, they uh, got baited into a resurrection. Not good. Not good, guys. 1-4, I don't like this. Don't know what's going on top lane. Don't know what's going on mid lane. But I can tell you one thing, it's probably not good. And Medusa is a person who could actually carry the game pretty hard, but I don't know if I can carry the farm against... carry the game against this much feed. It's 4 kills is pretty substantial 7 minutes into the game. Like, that's a lot of stuff to be giving up. Alright, we're going to max out the snake. Don't really know if that was necessary, but it's good to have, I guess. So we can do that. Uh, I think now time for some mana shield is going to be pretty worth it, I'd say. Get a little bit more durability. Oh, there's someone there. Not too sure who that is. Tinker's there. Could he kill me? There's an arrow from Marana or something that he can. Oh shit, there's a bat rider. Oh, I just walked right into that. But there we go. Stone gaze. Stone gaze, stone gaze, stone gaze. Help me please, guys. Please. Please. Missile no. Missile please. Flame break please. Tinker please. Alright. Jukes of hazard. And that's it. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye, Tinker. It's nice knowing you. I'm I'm gonna be over here if you if you need me. Didn't expect the bat to be there. Wow, that was quite clutch. But Stone Gay is pretty useful skill, I gotta say. Should I save money for my ultimate orb, or should I get a set of boots right now? Phase boots, I feel, would be really, really useful. 340. I can get the phase boots and a TP scroll. Maybe sell the stupid this thing. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do that. We could even, we could even go for this. Here we come, here comes everyone. Well, Bat Rider should get hit by the snake. There we go, there's one. Do we see two? Got two. Do we see three? Three? Third escape somewhere. But I'm not sure where. Let's get the mana shield. Don't really like mana shield, like as a skill. I'm not saying it's a bad skill or anything, I just don't like it. Uh but it is very useful. Now we have this aura on. We're going to turn that off. 
We have enough la damage to actually be of use to the team. Naga Siren, max out Riptide, good to see. And we should be able to put some hurt on this tower. Let's actually turn this aura on, take a couple more shots. As long as we don't take an arrow to the face or a uh, lasso, I think lasso should be coming up relatively soon. And of course, there's a Rubik there. Good thing arrow just wasted. Alright, so we can go for Perseverance, uh, or we can just save for the ultimate orb. Either way, it would be fairly decent to have. Uh, you know, the extra damage from Perseverance, the extra mana regeneration would be definitely nice. I'm kind of scared what's going on around these parts. So Marana's there. Let's throw a snake and see if we can hit her with it. No, we won't be able to hit her with it. And her arrow's a little bit faster. Oh shit, Rubik is here. Not enough mana. This is why I don't like this skill. Okay, let's do this one more time. Come on, boys. Yeah, I really don't like early game mana shields. It definitely saved my ass. I used all my mana to defend myself. But I still don't like it. I'm gonna get out of here. <laughs> this is not a good place to be. And I'm not really receiving too much support outside of that uh, little dive attempt that happened. And we're just gonna be falling on back. Turn this aura off again. Oh, she's gonna be dead. Hit mana burn. Oh, they're both low on mana. They're both low on mana. You could nail the Rubik right now if you wanted to, man. Do it, do it. Yes, impale. Mana burn. Dead. Easy kills. If we go up top lane, he has a hand of Midas. That's gonna be really, really troublesome. Let's go mid lane. There seems to be no one here. Hopefully, there's no arrow to greet me. There is not. Because Moran is on this bot lane. Or on the bot lane, rather. Doopa doopa doo. Really not getting as much farm. Our farm kind of slowed down after the cut first couple of minutes. What's up, Tinker? You want to really fight this? You really want to fight this with me? Yeah, take that. Down to half HP. Was that worth it? There's a bottle, so it might be. I'm going to go ahead and get the Perseverance. I feel like the uh, extra boost would be rather nice, and I can afford it right now. I don't really feel confident in my ability to farm that extra chunk of gold, so we're just going to go for the small items. Perseverance, get a little bit more damage going. And there's a Tinker. If we could hit him with a snake again, that would be nice. Boom, boom, boom. Wait, there's still people fighting down there? No, we're fighting over wards, apparently. This calls for Medusa. No, this actually doesn't. This might call for... No, this might not. I don't know. Still, the situation that calls for Medusa is questionable at best. Let's turn this aura on. They're still occupied down there. They're going to be heading for me shortly enough. But, I, they're, no, they're, they're dead. That guy's dead, at least. Yeah, Rubik's coming, I think. Someone might be coming. Honestly, I'm not sure if anyone's arriving in my area, but we got two of them in exchange for our support, so whatever, man. Whatever floats this boat is what I'll be okay with. And this should be the tower. Had the aura going, and unless SK and Batrider both come, this should be as good as mine. Mucho dinero. Let's go down to this bot lane. Mind, Continue worry. our farm there, and Queen of Pain could do something else with her time. She'll just have to forfeit the tower to me, the uh, lane to me. Where's my guy going? Thought I told you to go over here. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm crazy. Who knows? Okay, let's just kill this wolf because it's gonna piss me off later on if someone's. I know it's gonna piss someone off in the team if they're jungling and it's like, wait, there's no, there's nothing here. There's just one wolf. All right, so Tinker's here, Marana's here, and that's not gonna hit me. Not a chance about that. Well, they're still, like, attacking me. That's really mean, actually. Oh, <laughs> hit the Queen of Pain. Look at that. That's funny. Come on. Come get me. Bait, bait, bait. How is it that I'm always at, like, no HP? What is going on with this game? And the core is just leaving. I'm pretty sure they would want to go for this Queen of Pain again. Tinker's around, and he wants it. You know he does. As long as I remain out of sight. Out of sight, out of sight. Queen of Pain, fight them! I'm here to back you up, man. Oh, here we go. Nyx is here. I wonder if I get them to come and get me. Oh, no, that's not Nyx. That's Venomancer. Okay, baiting, baiting hard. We baiting. 
We're baiting so hard. There we go. Burn that spell. And now, Snake, dead. Oh shit, it's Marana. Well, that trade is just one that we're gonna have to make. Okay, okay, that is not what I wanted to see. I wanted to see something that was a little bit more friendly. Damn it, wolves, where are you doing? What are you doing there? Bat behind us. That might not be behind us. There he is. Wish I had my uh, healing self, but I don't have it. He's gonna want to go for this Venomancer. I don't know why Venomancer walked right into that. That didn't seem like a good idea to me. Oh, whoa, he's now in trouble. No, he has a Blink Dagger. Oh, shit, we're in trouble. We in trouble. Tinker is doing a lot of damage. He has a full nuking build. Yeah, yeah, I'm afraid I myself is going to have to override your freaking Null Talisman, Paro. That is your real name. Okay, come on, Courier. You got your you got your Null Talisman. What more could you possibly want out of life? These guys are really doing a good job at keeping this lane dangerous for me. I don't like that. I'd much rather have them... Ooh, that could have been dangerous. Oh, that guy is going to... Well, well this could also be interesting. Really? You're going to do this? Okay, that actually hurt a lot. So we're just going to pop this and be fine. That hurt way too much, man. That really, really hurt. And, uh, well, it looks like they died up there. So now we're in trouble. We probably shouldn't be here. They're gonna dive me. I have orange to support, but Nyx and, uh, Nyx and Queen decided to go off and get themselves killed. Hey, look, it's Bat. And that guy is screwed now. I cannot help you. We could help you, with though, with Siren. We got the gang together. Got some fish people. I think Medusa's more of a snake than a fish, but close enough. We got some Tinker Illusions, we got Pink with definitely enough mana for an arrow, but nothing else. Hmm. Lane is a little bit rough. That's definitely a fake. Well, we could farm this. We could afford to farm this. Especially if we land a Mystic Snake hit on a couple people. Yes. Mana for me, bring it to me, Snake. There we go, lots of mana. Come on, Skeleton King. Oh, nope, that's not gonna work. Okay, we could... Save him from the gale, that... Yeah, we're under their tower right now. This is something that I don't want to be a part of in any way, shape, or form. That was the stupidest fight we could have taken. These guys are dumb. Not the good dumb, either. The bad dumb. Get out. Let him have it. Or you could go back there and die, probably, maybe. No, you're not going to die. So, yeah, but these guys are way too over-aggressive. This, uh, Nixon, especially this Siren, that was like suicide. It, we're in a tier 1 tower. And you're going to dive them with a... You're going to dive them with your ultimate. That is just spells doom. That gives them, like, all the time in the world to figure out what's going on and actually get a TP scroll. Your bottom tower has fallen. So yeah, that's not exactly the best of ideas. Would not recommend that. 2 out of 10. Would not push again. So close to my item. There we go. Got it. Let's get this level 2. It actually makes it cheaper. Cool. Zero mana. I did not realize it was zero mana at level 3. That's really awesome right there. Uh, this Tinker Laser build is being really annoying, and he's really farmed. And Queen of Pain dying solo to Marana? What is happening to this world right now? Queen of Pain, how many times have you died? Four. And three deaths on the Siren, four on the Venomancer. And I'm over here, living every single time. I feel kind of bad. I feel like I should be, uh, you know, doing a little bit more, taking a couple more bullets for the team, but... Hell, if the team wants to take all the bullets for me, then I'm going to be fine with that. But I need a lot more gold, because I'm not getting too, too much. At least force them back off the tower. Heading on to our Lincoln Sphere. It's going to be so slow. 20 minutes. Actually, not... It's going to be like 23 or something like that. And if I survive this incoming hassle that's going to be going on in the mid lane. I feel like something's coming for me. 
I do have backup, and okay, well, you could have that one, I guess. Ooh, we're full mana, look at that. Venomancer, balls of steel going up there, man, let's do it. I don't know why I want to do this, it's probably not a good idea. You just throw a couple more snakes out at the mid lane. Get more gold, get more gold. Get more gold. Oh my god, they're all there. They're going for Roshan, they're going for Roshan, they're going for Roshan. Oh, this is going to hurt them a lot. Take the Aegis. We got it. Well done, lads. Oh, yes, we see you. <laughs> Perfect timing. I don't know who made that call. It definitely wasn't me. I can tell you something, that that call was the correct call to make. Send in the illusions, or yourself. There you go. That was great. We jacked the Aegis. Do we still have the Aegis? We lost the Aegis to something. Hey, wait, wait, wait. What's going on here? What are you doing? Damn it. <laughs> Naga Siren, why? Out. Naga, please. Whatever, we got our got our thing. Now we can start building up a couple more things. We're actually not farming too too badly. We got the thing in one minute after getting a couple kills in that Roshan pit. Two assists actually is what we got. Hey, we still got a couple picked off. Look at that. Wouldn't be a game if you didn't have people dying in the retreat. Come on, courier. Grab the items for me. Thank you. And we're going to be going right over here so we can easily defend this mid lane push that's about to come. We got our Lincoln Sphere, so that'll help us survive quite a bit more. Let's see what else is recommended. Manta style, I do like that decision just because they, don't, they have a lot of single target. If I get my Manta style up, that would be real nice. Yasha is going to come up first. We need another ultimate orb, but stat stacking is what Dusa is all about. We'll be able to split shot things left and right. We can start getting some split shot as well because we don't actually have any of that quite yet. Would be very useful to have. Start uh, start flash farming around the map. I do like to go for the defensive build on Dusa, like in general. I just feel like it's you're better safe farming than like farming really quickly and then losing it time and time again. Bat Rider, baby. That's risky. Oh my god, he's gonna get him. Oh my god, he got him. Well, he burned a lot for it, but he's dead. This guy's dead too. Oh, he stole the ultimate. Not bad. Okay, we have a lot of people coming in here. Back. Back. I know why you know back. Oh my god, why are these people so aggressive? These people are suicidal. And not the good way either. Maybe I should have gotten a magic wand, but we keep on like feeding them. We saw that they were coming. We definitely did. LOL, LOL. No. <laughs> That's not gonna happen. Mm, he doesn't have that much mana, but I would like to fall back right about now if I get another snake out. There we go. Snake. Snake do some damage. Help me with this. Good work, snake. Defend the tower and try not to die in the process. Of course, that second part is always the hardest part. Okay, Nyx. That's kill for you right there. Nope, maybe not. I'll be here. No, nope, uh, I, I will not be here. I changed my mind. Nyx got over aggressive. Kel surprise. He paid for it with his life once again. The Skeleton King's gonna get a kill. Blink. Very nice. You know, it's not too late to get a magic wand. I don't know if it'll help me. It probably will, since it gives me mana, which equals health for my guy. Probably should go ahead and get that. Hmm, I think I am safe down here. I want to get the Asha first, at least. The mobility will definitely help, and I want to have a little bit more of my right clicks. Because going for the Lincoln Sphere first, even though I did go for Phase Boots, means that my right clicks are not going to be too intense. Okay, I probably should watch out right now. Actually, there's two spotted. Tinker's Travels, though. Rubik not available to come gank me. I'll just play it a little bit cautiously. They won't find me here, right? We do have a Bat Rider. Okay, so we should probably get out of here. I think we'll be safe to just walk on out of here. 
you know, maybe Yasha, Magic Stick, and then something, and then finish up the match style. I have a lot of mana shield now, so it's giving me some very effective coverage versus these golems. And that's what you gotta cover yourself versus the golems. Gotta get in there, don't I? Don't wanna go right up to the front lines because that'll happen. Actually, that's the best possible scenario for us. Let's do this shit. You're dead. You're dead. Skeletal King. You're a little bit unhappy, but mostly happy. Well, this guy's gonna die at least. Right? Get this guy next. Come on, couple more shots, couple more shots. Got him. Ugh, not enough for that. And dodge whatever he casted. That actually didn't go too bad. Oh, man, I could have gotten my thing. My ultimate orb. Whatever. That could have gone worse. That's exactly what I meant, man. Look at that, we're on the save wave wavelength. Alright, so we got our Yasha. We could have gotten our ultimate orb, which probably would have been the much better decision, because I don't know when I'm going to have 2100 gold ever again. Hopefully it won't be too long. Regardless, that fight actually went pretty well. Got a couple kills, and they have yet to bring me down. So that's pretty much the best case scenario for a Medusa player. If you could stay alive, what more could you want out of your fights, right? I should turn this mana shield off so we don't lose any unnecessary mana. And we have a free ultimate. Look at that. Ain't that some shit. That initiation was actually really effective by Naga Siren. I think it was accidental as well. Like, a good thing she got that song off right before the arrow hit. Because if the arrow hit and then the song didn't go off, then she would have been dead instantly. And then we would have been screwed. Manta style. It's going to be a little bit of a pain to deal with the Tinker and the Firefly with this Manta style illusions, but I feel like it will help. It'll definitely help. Let's push this out one more, once more, and, uh, hello, back. Get him. Oh, yeah. Thank you for your mana contribution. Okay, there's a lot of people here. Don't know where the arrow's coming. If it's coming at all, it's not going to come at all, actually. No. Why are you so over-aggressive? We already went over this. This is not something that you're supposed to be doing. I thought I raised you better than this. Net on someone? There we go. This guy's screwed. Really? Well, wait, wait. Where is everyone going? We're backing up. Okay. I'm not too ready yet to, uh, I guess, go for 1v4s. So we're just going to back this train up. We have our Lincoln Sphere. Let's try to bait out a Hellfire Blaster. At least clear the wave without getting killed ourselves. There we go. Lasso, don't know if it's used, but we're almost at our ultimate orb, so we're still farming pretty decently. That's really what we want right now. We just need more gold. I don't know why we keep on suiciding into these. It seems like Nick Sasson will never ever learn that his antics are doomed to fail from the start. Hey, hello. That's exactly what I have Lincoln's fear for. Back up, back up. Yeah, I'm not doing enough damage to this guy. I need more. Definitely need a lot more damage. But Deuce isn't really a single target carry. She's more of a AoE, kill everything at the same time carry, much like Gyrocopter. So in a man fight, you're most likely not going to win versus many carries, especially if it's like an anti-mage or something. But uh, if you, you'll you do shared damage to the entire team, and that is most of the time enough to be rather effective in fights. You do stuff like this. Wait, that's a Tinker. LOL, I have Lincoln Sphere still, bro. Hey, look, Tinker actually blinked away. That's not gonna hit me. This might hit, might hit blue again. We know all, we all know how much blue enjoys getting hit by damn arrows. Are they really gonna push this? That's the big question. No, Lincoln Sphere. Oh shit. You're not moving anywhere. Oh no, the arrow. Keep keep singing. Keep singing, wench. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Magic stick, magic stick, magic stick, magic stick. Run, 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 run. No, we're gonna die. They shouldn't have... These guys keep on taking fights that, quite frankly, we're not able to take. They should have just, like, sang, and then once they realized that it was over, then just let me die. Because we're just dying a lot. 
And that's not really helping. Also, Venomancer and Queen of Pain also apparently had better things to do than come in. Don't think it would have helped, but... Venomancer. Venomancer. Get in there. That's your job. That's your only job. Oh, no, don't do that. Oh, God. Lasso should be down. Guys. Oh, Venno, what are you doing? Why, Venno? Why are you moving forward? You just plant wards and poke at them. You're, you're not going to defend this without Queen of Pain. Who, by the way, is still doing something. And Oh, look, we're over-aggressive again because we didn't realize that they have vision. If you guys just keep feeding them, that would be fantastic. I have a feeling that it's not going to be challenging enough with, with them doing what, what they're doing right now. Too bad Siren's chilling near the tower and not doing anything. We would have had a, a disable on one of those, but she decided to chill. God, these people are so oblivious of, like, how powerful their heroes are. It's like, yes, you're an Nyx Assassin, that's all well and good, but they're pretty damn stacked right now. we get another ancient stack in a couple seconds. Let's burn that one down in a second. Then get our mana style from it. More lizards. Thunder hides. Alright, screw buyback. We needed to get bigger stuff so we could try to keep alive. But with these racks down, I mean, it's not going to worry me too much. I can clear off these uh, super creeps pretty easily, but knowing my team, they're all going to do stupid shit and then die a whole lot. Where's my courier? What the hell? Why is everyone messing with this courier? Oh no, please don't go in there, Nyx. Please don't go in there. He's going to go in there. I'm trying to get this Bat Rider, but I don't really have much damage, guys. Lincoln Sphere? Okay, now I'm going to say it's stunned. Siren, help me! Okay, we don't have True Sight, do we? Nope. Peace. You're on your own. Okay, I would like some assistance right now. Sonic Wave! Hey, that almost hit something. It's like Nyx doesn't realize that they have True Sight. And we are uh, not farmed enough to carry this one just yet against an SK1 from Midas. I think really the fact that we have 9 deaths, 9 deaths, 8 deaths, that is just. It's just not helping at all. <laughs> like, they're all at relatively low amounts of deaths, and I my death count is also pretty low. But, uh, yeah, just dying that much versus SK. Letting them have that, like, global map control with, like, Queen of Pain constantly diving and dying and stuff like that. Definitely not helping out. Unfortunately, I need a little bit more damage if I'm going to actually do anything. And I think Butterfly is probably the best way to get it. The right click that I'm facing up against right now. Venomancer is doing something. Place of Ward. Picks fail. Well, not really. We, it's not that. Four agility doesn't mean anything. Two of our agilities are support heroes. It's like, oh, we have too much agility. No, we actually don't, because you're essentially an int hero. Venomancer is essentially a nothing hero, because his agility doesn't mean anything. So really, like, I'm the only agility hero, and Naga Siren, I guess, that's kind of a weak duo. The, uh, Deuce of Siren. But you know what? I got Deuce of first, and she decided to get Siren right after, so... It's not my responsibility. Do the damage, do the damage. Yay! Maybe this game isn't over quite yet. We keep getting picks on them because they're dumb. Do some AoE damage like this, which is rather spectacular. Fireworks are spectacular this time of year. 
We just have to make sure our mid lane is pushed out and make sure that I continue to get farm. If I get a butterfly up, that would definitely help, but still, they're getting right on top of me and making me unhappy, so I don't really know what I can do about that. I don't have a TP scroll, and they're once again caught out of position. Run! Run! Ultimate, Venomancer, you don't have anything for your ultimate. Sonic Wave, they're all lined up! No, you don't want a Sonic Wave unless they're uh, all about to die, I see. Oh god. Nope. The Skeleton King is way too big right now. He just got way too much something. I have a Lincoln Sphere charge. I could be fine to fight this guy out. Do we have an Impale? We don't have an Impale. We don't have anything. We have a dead Nyx Assassin who's going to get killed in like three chops. Or one chop. That's also a thing. You throw a snake at him. That's about it. Hey guys. Are going to kill this guy or what? No, we're going to get killed by missiles. That sounds like a good idea as well. What you doing, Tinker? Alright, this is something that we could actually might be able to get behind. Ah, that guy's dead now. Probably defend that. But that actually went not too poorly, all things considered. Queen of Pain does a lot of damage. We, if we just keep this SK down, which seems pretty easy since they're not really defending their SK too well. We should be able to make a little bit of a comeback in this game. I'm not ready. As long as we stop being too over aggressive. See, right now against three, I should be fine to fight my way out of it, or at least bring a couple down before I die. And I do have enough buyback, gold, uh, gold to buy back. Do I? Yeah, I do. Have, I definitely have enough gold to buy back. All right, let's just send these guys down. Don't see a fight coming anytime soon, so we don't need to keep them in our pocket. Tamarana's around, Batrider's around, but we'll just burst down these creeps like nobody's business. And go down to the bot lane, put more momentum down there, and uh, creeps st stayed alive, because my illusions still don't do much damage. 150 plus 13 is really not the damage number that I would like to see right now. Would like to get a little bit more. I feel like a Divine Rapier would be a good bet, actually. Do I want to... Ever using split shot is bad. Yeah, I'm farming with split shots, so... The only time I have split shot on is uh, when I am actually pushing in with my illusions, and then I typically focus someone with single target stuff. Hey, look, someone's dying? No, someone's not dying. Split shot's not what you want to have in the fights, I don't think, unless you have a divine rapier. So right now, it kills my damage. You know, I'm going to be forced to go for a divine rapier. There's really, uh, we're a little bit too far behind at this point, so we're just going to make a uh, Hail Mary. Everyone knows Hail Mary's the best kind of Mary. If we can get that item up. Gamble it all. All or nothing, right? All or nothing. Which will be a spectacular end to a rather mediocre game, even if we do die with it and give it to their SK. Which then will be really impossible to take it off. Kill everything! Kill everything, yeah! Split shot it. And we need another TP scroll. You guys farm me a TP scroll. Stat. Bat Rider. Did he go north? I think he did go north. I'm walking straight into him, but I have a, I have a Lincoln Sphere, so I should be fine. All right, we're getting a lot of gold right now. Would like to save enough for buyback, but really, I think going all in is probably the best decision. I need just need more. The, I just need the extra damage. Probably wouldn't be there if I were you, bro. Uh, we could sell the friggin' this thing. Get down here. We gotta defend this shit. Play guards. Level 2 Plague Wards? Level 2 Plague Wards? What's going on? It's like, what? Are you try? Are you toying with me? Is that... Are you being serious right now? 
You only went level two in the Plague Wards. It's not like that's the best skill for a sire for a, someone to have. Kill this guy. Good thing this guy just still doesn't have a BKB. Just man fight him a little bit. Stop a Lincoln Sphere, you're not gonna kill me. I'm trying a build I saw. Where did you see it? And like That's because it's a pub build. It's horrible. Oh my god. That's why we're not hit holding these pushes. Because we have someone who's going for the stupidest build of all time. You don't want to go for this build. It doesn't scale well at all. That's not why what Panamancer does. I have six, seven stacks of Tar on me. I'm going to back the hell up right now. Yeah, I don't have any movement speed. Is it even worth popping Manta for this guy? I think it is. Shoot him down. Got him. Seriously, who the hell would go for that build? People go for that build because they don't know that Plague Wards are good. Oh, we're still chasing. Look at that. Oh my god. I mean, every single level on Venomancer is valuable. You don't want to waste a single skill point because you're a support hero. You don't know when your next skill point is going to come. And going for Gale? That is not helpful at all. Level The slow doesn't scale at all. You get a little bit more damage, yes. But I'm pretty sure with a Nyx behind you and a Queen of Pain, you're going to be okay in the damage department. I'm pretty sure. That is the most... Oh my god. And Poison Sting as well. If you're, if you're looking to carry, if you don't have a Medusa on your team, then yeah, go for that build. Try to be a carry. Go ahead. Best of luck. But if you do have a Medusa on your team, who could actually do things... Then you want to let her do those things. It's a good thing I'm going for this Divine Rapier, because God knows we're going to need it. Yes. Let's wait for the Creep Wave. And send this in. Okay, we are not We're not supposed to be in here right now. <laughs> We've won too many. We're going to be safe, though. So that's fine enough. Keep these towers safe. Get a little more farm this, on the lanes. Maybe get some Ancient Stacks. That might give us enough for our Divine Rapier. Going for the doctor. Because we're two axes down anyway. So what could possibly go wrong, right? Worst comes to worst, they snipe it and take the game. But they're close to the game anyway. Guys, I have my divine rapier. Please don't engage on something... Oh, hey, they got Obama. Obama's always out of position. Should I hide it now? That's the big question. I think I should hide it. Try to hide it. I keep it hidden. Screw it, we're not gonna hide it. We need to deal with this. Alright, so we have the creep clearing. Now I have to make sure that I am not anywhere near that these fights. Problem with this is that I don't have any way of uh, coming back if I give it to the Skeleton King, so I probably shouldn't leave the base without my team. And uh, my illusions still don't do much damage, so Manta Style is fairly useless. But hey, I do a lot of damage, and I'm okay with that. Look at this. Of course I got it already. I haven't been farming all game for nothing. I'm buying important things. Go for it. I should be fine. I have a my Howl of Stone stuff, and... I have a Lincoln Sphere, I have a Manta Style. I should be okay. Where's our smoke? We're gonna smoke? Naga Siren don't wanna smoke. Naga Siren is roughed up for some reason. Do we have the smoke? Someone take it? No one has the smoke! What are they doing? These people are retarded. Oh my god. Good job, Naga. I really hope it was worth tanking all that shit. And then missing in the smoke. Did it miss? Did he really not get hit by the smoke? So, yep, gotta go all in. Oh, they're not here. They went the other way. They're gonna push top. Just get more momentum here. No sense in trying to gank them with this now. 
They know we're coming. You're walking right into them. See? It's like... Your top tower is under attack. Your top tower has fallen. These people are retarded. It's like, oh yeah, we're let's chase them through everything. Make it so completely obvious that they have with the smoke on the board. Yeah, I'm not doing anything to this guy right now. I'm doing a lot of damage to everyone else. Fight to the death. Oh, please keep him away from me. Keep him away from me. Ah, ah, ah. I have another Lincoln Spear. I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Oh my god, I got so many levels off of that, but now we're going to lose Rax's. Divine Rapier is good. If we had our entire team there, if they didn't decide to suicide, that would really help be helpful. We'd actually be able to fight them. Die. Uh, kill them all. Is he gonna stun me? Yeah, he is, but he's not. He's not. Divine Rapier, buddy. Divine Rapier. This is the Hail Mary play that I was hoping for. Mid. Now I wish I had some life steal. I really do. But I have a Lincoln Sphere, I'll have my Manta style if I could keep dodging SK's uh, stuff. Where is everyone? Nyx is down there, that's kind of warranted. Oh my god, oh my god, this guy has like an attention span of a three year old! Not a good three year old either. Get in there with your Gale, bro. Is that gonna turn around? Come on, turn around. I had some way of disrupting that, but I don't. And now we can't push anymore. Oh yeah, Bat Rider, you want to go? I might. I have my posse with me. We'll take you. We'll take you on. Get a crit. I don't know. Crit would be nice. Although butterfly would help. No, I'm, I got to get the crit. I need single target damage. Single target damage. And let's uh, ditch this wand or something. So they're just gonna get true sight up. There we go. Good Queen of Pain. Who's a good Queen of Pain? Game's not over yet. I still do a lot of damage. If they could get to me. I actually forgot to use my ultimate last fight. But that Queen of Pain, with what she was doing right there, that is what will lose us the fight. Let me tell you that. Are they really going to try to backdoor it? Because I'll be happy to fight them with backdoor protection up. I'm maxed out right now, pretty much. I probably even shouldn't even save for buyback, but I can't even buy the crit even if I wanted to, so... Uh, would like to get the... Would just buy out for Daedalus right now. That's what I would do if I could get the courier over there. But then I don't even have the recipe, so... Either way, we should be fine as long as I stay safe. If I stay safe, stay shooting, this game is not over yet. But if they catch me, then it's all over. <laughs> Send these in. Yeah, they do some pretty good damage. Ooh, that crit. We had a 44 Aegis? Roche 44, yeah. We took out the Aegis, I believe. Oh shit, they're here! Oh no, what are you doing? Turn it off! Oh, turn it off, turn it off, turn it off! Oh my god. No! Oh, I had Purge up! That silly friggin' Naga Siren just lost us the game. Mid push, everyone.
Okay, I'll do it by myself. Jesus Christ. Naga Siren, I don't think she knows, but she should know that she just lost us the game. If she just kept the ultimate off, then I would have had enough time to... Uh, my ultimate would have slowed them down, slowed their attack speed down to the point where they could not function. But instead, she decided to pop it and completely screw us all over. Right, this tower is going to feel the wrath of a Divine Rapier. We need my Daedalus also. This is the only chance we got. And apparently it doesn't block arrow, so taking a couple shots from this, it's fine. Keep going. We stop for no one. No, screw TP. We're not TPing out of here. We're gonna take these. Okay, we're gonna pussy out, aren't we? We are. Get in there, fools! Oh, completely out of mana. They abandon ship! Why would you run? We're up against Megas. Now they have a Divine Rapier. Now the game's over. See, normally I would say, yeah, they're coming up, we should probably move back, but we're up against Mega Creeps, and we can't beat Mega Creeps. So, yeah, that secondary fight just, like, kind of secondarily lost us the game. Go Nyx Assassin. Oh, he almost got Marana, but you... Oh, he did get Marana. No, Teal build. Your middle tower is under I mean, just a little more burst damage. You could have taken the Bat Rider down. But, we have enough for buyback. Not going to make a difference anyway. They have a Divine Rapier somewhere on the Tinker. So, Medusa Game 2 was a decent showing of what Medusa can actually do for you. But, unfortunately, I didn't have the team to back me up. We had way too much over-aggression. And, well, you can't really do everything yourself. Even though Divine Rapier is a pretty good item on Dusa. So, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, like, comment, subscribe. If you did not, let me know why. Other than that, GG. GG! Oh, yeah, plus 123 bonus. That's nice.